for the fact that some people just want to change the narratives they call evil good and they call good evil that does not stop those who know the right thing to be oppressed or to be suppressed or don't allow yourself to be suppressed because you can see the glaring things happening in this country everything happening in this country we know that they're doing buari's era tinubu never said anything even while his region was being was being uh, uh, dealt with for that in terms of a uh, insecurity and that was the reason why up to today Igbo is not in the country this man never said anything what he only said was that uh, people should come and prove whether it was the Fulani who were killing people at the end of the day it was discovered that they were the ones but when election time came he started uh, uh, acting as if uh, he loves them and the worst part of it is that uh, the same set of people know the truth that this man is never it's never been good to them. This is on, <laughs> this 2023 has really opened many people's eyes. And they are coming out with both faces, of course. And that was the reason why they allowed all the atrocities committed by Tinumbu. They allowed it in the Southwest. Majority of them allowed it. Go and check. Go and check almost all of them coming on social media, going to national and uh, to conventional media houses to defend atrocities of Tinumbu. And they think uh, they are doing well. But the bone of contention is that uh, they will say, oh, uh, some people are bad losers. Those who are bad losers are better than somebody who calls himself a president. That the global embarrassment is not just for him and them alone. It's just for everybody. And they are still coming out to defend. They are coming out to defend. You are seeing black. They will say, no, it is not. It is, it is red. When in the deposition of the Chicago State University, they said they did not produce this result this certificate that this man submitted to them and they say oh that means they never said it is a forgery they never said it is for you they will your kuru kuru high they will change it during answers they said people did not die a lot of them came out and began to say no it is not it is true nobody died and all of that but after many years they are coming to tell us that they needed they are budgeting how many millions of naira for burial of a wounded and something people at the end of the day, they'll see come out and say, oh, it did not happen at uh, the Lake Ito Gate. The ones that happen across, across, uh, across only legal states. Really? <laughs> oh my God. The only prayer, me, I will only, I will only pray is that as many who, who are into evil, evil will continue to follow you. If you see the truth and you are trying to paint it because of whatever reason, you will go in for it. That's it. You will go in for it. You will go in for it. You will not escape it. He who knows how to do good, continue to do good. And if you know how to do otherwise, continue. You must get your reward. No, there's no way. There's no two ways about it. Like I said from the beginning, those who are on the side of the truth, you just have to continue with that. You say, oh, some people are bad losers. I've never seen anybody in this world, they say, oh, you lost an election day, it will not be, it will become an embarrassment, it will become a shame, it will be, you know, the plague will not be on you. Oh, this one lost election, I've never seen that. It is your constitutional right, you have to recontest if you want to. But with this kind of a, you know, they prefer just being in that position with this embarrassment, it means nothing to them. They talk about a third party that issued the certificate for Tinumbu. If the people are really genuine, why would the, these people not say, oh, yes, we authorize these people to issue the certificate or whatever diploma, irrespective of what they want to call it? Because some people are coming now to tell us, to try to twist the whole thing. Oh, America's system is different. Uh, this and that is different. Really? If it is different, no matter what, all of us will still come back to equilibrium, you know, in uh, the terminology, everything will still be the same. It's just like uh, some people say, oh, they are in, in, in the UK, they say they are, they are doing placement. Oh, in Nigeria, they will say, oh, you are doing IT or attachment. But in other places, they will call it an uh, internship. But at the end of the day, everybody understands what everyone is talking about. The terminology might be different, but you cannot come and tell us that there's a way they do it in America. And I've been asking this question, if it were to be in Nigeria, you think uh, this uh, Madonado, the judge, would have 
the Nigerian judge would have said, oh, let them release it. They will never. And at the end of the day, they are coming out to tell us that uh, the meaning of the irreparable damage that Tinubu was talking about, it was a miscarriage of justice. That was all they were saying. Hi. Hmm. I fear we no fear some Nigerians. Oh. Why will you? You know, we even we are saying, we are seeing some people that they are terrible in nature. They want to talk of other African countries. They say, oh, yes, they hate Nigerians, they hate Nigerians. Why would they not? You, you as an individual just have to prove yourself that say, oh, you are different from those people that they are talking about. Now, nah, Osh Poppy, eh, Tinubu, all this, eh, majority of them from the Southwest, they are into all this whole thing. We have other tribes that are even doing all manner of nonsense. When you come to, eh, what, is, what do they call it? Identity theft. All this, eh, you see this other one who they call eh, Naramali. You can imagine that eh, his case that they were handling, they said they saw him about how many, how many ATM cards with him, credit card with him. At the end of the day, they stopped. But because of this Mobab thing issue, they are coming to revisit it. And I was like, why did you stop it? So they just want to digress, divert attention and 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 and, and make the gullibles and the wicked ones to continue in their gullibility and ignorance. They will always want to twist things. But the bone of contention, the reason why I'm talking now is today is that they will tell you, eh, some people are bad losers. Some people are bad losers, but it's a shame that somebody will cause it. Let me see how Tinubu will be moving around. He wants to be president. I want to be your president. Everything about him is just wrong. Everything. We have a lot of people in the university. Some people have been rusticated. You will not even know. Maybe some close party will know. But some people see being in school, you will not even know that they've been rusticated. They will be in school for the duration of a, the, the course. Everybody, even their parents at home, will think they will not go back home. We see, we know the majority of them. They will not go back home. They will think that they are in school. So that kind of person, they say they are in school. The question is that if Tinubu, now the lawyer, Eba, Mike Eba also, went to Chicago State University, they gave him the subpoena. They said, oh, it was not true. But at, at the end of the day, we got to know that, you know, the certificate was subpoena to him. So why is it that the owner of the resort, you could not go to the school and get it, and get the resort? And now they are beginning, they are being pained. They say, oh, they want to shut down Arise TV because they say they are defaming Tinubu. How many, how many of them, how many media houses do we have, social media or conventional media houses do we have, compared to individuals who are even journalists now on social media? Those ones are even more dangerous because the whole thing will just be going, will be spreading fast. The news from social media spreads fast and that's the conventional houses. How many of these are conventional houses? How many of them? How many? How many of the uh, 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 foreigners watch uh, our conventional media houses? But you, as an individual in a foreign country, you have friends or friends or friends. Before you know, they just can be transferring anything to you. Before it goes further than that of the this thing. So you want to make it official, like somebody said, this whole thing is beyond Supreme Court. It's beyond Supreme Court, irrespective of what the Supreme Court will say. The truth is just the truth of course nigerians have preempted them that this is exactly what they are going to do and what the government or the judiciary is going to do they've started telling you so that they will prepare your mind but that does not change anything so